Hello everyone, I am back with the session and uh, we're going to be talking about in the in this thing we're going to be talking about do while right so the conditional uh, uh, thing the loop sorry the looping kind of thing in last session we have seen the decision task how if you give if this then do that now we will see how to loop around right so it's very very simple it uh, it's much simpler than what you might be thinking I will just demonstrate it so what I'll do is just say add do while uh, let me tell you again once again this is nothing but looping okay so till you um, till the condition is satisfied it keeps on looping if the condition is not met it will stop that's it very very simple so let's just learn uh, with an example instead of um, I'm, I think I'm talking a lot so let me just uh, say drag and drop it now what you need to do is you need to select all this thing you can select one by one or you can select the multiple elements so multiple things also you can do it so since it's in the okay I think we have uh, created them in a sequence anyway so just drag and uh, drop it then uh, this one also drag and drop it okay so here done um, pretty simple right now what, where is the condition so the condition is we will give the condition here I will say that grade so grade till grade is not equal to a okay just loop on i mean if the grade is a stop if uh, otherwise loop on see this is do while do while means even if i give a wrong value it will execute it once okay uh, unlike while in while if you give a wrong value it will not execute at all so just uh, let's say run it run then uh, just see the value so let me give uh, C. Can you see it's looping around? If I give anything else, it will just loop around. Okay. It will not stop. If I give A, just see it got executed, then it will stop. Okay. Now it will stop. So understood? It's a very, very simple thing. Do, okay. Whatever condition uh, you want, you can give here. So in this box, you can give a condition and then it will execute. It's very simple, right? It's much simpler than what you thought, right? In two minutes, I think you have mastered what is a do while condition. So I hope you're practicing with me. Uh, that makes it very simpler. Thanks guys. Thank you very much for watching this session. Thanks.